I'm just going to give you kind of a general pass over stream of uh, the expo floor. Oh, someone's calling my name. I heard someone say Moose anyway. There we go. There's Brad. You're on can camera. <laughs> I don't know if anyone's watching yet, but uh, but yeah. So this is Brad M. We're doing well. Just giving an overview of uh, at this expo. There's El Gargantuan right there. Got to see him. It's busy see so man. Far here. Yeah, you as well. I'll come back when people I'm done doing this. There's a lot. Yeah. So we got uh, we got lots of people here. There's lots of streamers that uh, that I've gotten to know of over the time. It's been a lot of fun. So this is the just chatting booth. There's uh, John Fly sitting over there with uh, some other guys. And there's just a lot of a lot of people. There's about I'm told there's about 1,500 people here this year. So it is a, uh, a fantastic turnout. And uh, just a lot to see, a lot to do. I'm going to give you some general overview, and then we'll stream again later with some specifics. So um, I know I got a request to look at the uh, Quality Wings uh, 787 at one point, and uh, we will check that out as well. TFDI is over here, featuring uh, talking about their True Glass and their 717, obviously. Got some cool things happening. Navigraph has an epic booth over here. Of course, doing awesome stuff with me. There's Gong Show Kid right there. Streamers looking at streamers. This is like a <laughs> Mr. Bergman, how are you? Doing well, sir. How are you? I'm good. That's right. Just ran into Brad M. So I finally found him. He's right over there down the end. So how's your tour going? Of, of just Expo? just started. So we're just uh, walking around. So we'll see what happens. Take it easy. All righty. All right, so like I said, just, you just constantly run into people around here that you, that you find on stream. It's really cool. Prop wash simulations, they got some cool hardware that you can uh, that you can purchase here. A Volair Sim and their big old setup here. How would you like to have this at home, guys? This is this is just a cool looking uh, looking deal right there. Big old three wraparound screens, seat to sit in. Guys flying around the ultimate home cockpit simulator for uh, for doing that. Now here, this is uh, Project Fly. Uh, this is Metar Simulations area, so primarily Project Fly. So got the uh, the venerable Matt Davies over here, looking like he's doing something. Making sure my presentation doesn't fail me. That would be good. <laughs> All right, as we kind of move over here, we've got uh, Pro Sim 737 flight control training setups. Noble flight simulation over here. Try to get you a feel of how big this room is. I'm going to step back here a little bit and just kind of give you an overview. I mean, this is a, a very large space. It's all filled with different booths and exhibitors. And this is only one part of the of the convention. This is the, the free room, but they have obviously uh, actual seminars that you know, will take you in there and have presentations. We just got done watching the uh, add-on developers uh, thing hosted by Chili Willy. So this is uh, Active Sky and Cloud Arts and Hi-Fi simulations uh, set up. So you got stuff where you can try out the various sims. You know, FS Expo is great for nothing else if you want to come and just kind of experience some stuff that you wouldn't normally be able to afford to try and test. And so you can kind of see what appeals to you, what doesn't, what's, uh, what's really cool, what's not. So Midcon Air. Check out this, uh, this yoke setup this guy's got over here. This is just epic. I mean, look at that. You have to have one of those things. VAT start training. This is great. This is a great service if you are looking to learn how to do VAT sim. And check out VAT star training. That's this right here. VATstar.com. This is this is where you want to be at. BW Flight Simulation, how you doing? Kramer, good to see you. You should go try the laminar research. Oh, we will. We will. This is this is the, the early on. Check it out and see what's going on. We've already run into a number of people. Uh, Jeff Fabiano, is over, this is his booth. I don't see him over here at the moment, but this is his uh, setup station. He's going to be live streaming from here early, later today. Just some cool, cool stuff. This is such a such a neat event. You definitely need to try and be here next year if you can. I'm going to show you this. This is cool. So I'm going to 
I'm gonna run you guys over here because there's something to see. I'm in, I'm not an Airbus guy. I'm the I'm the Boeing guy, but this there's just something too cool over here that you gotta see. I think I'm on the wrong side of the building though. I gotta make my way over to it. Nope, nope, I'm on the right side. Bear with me, you guys. So tons of people crowding around, so it's hard to see. So we're gonna do our best to try to get in here. This is like a full-on Airbus, Airbus cockpit. Look at this. Is that nuts or what? How much do you think that cost? <laughs> you got, I'm going to try to get you a little better view here. There we go. You got overhead panel and everything. It is pretty epic. And then here's the feet of what they're doing right now. Flying their own. So I'll make an attempt to try that out later. But you got... Uh, other Orbex setups over here. Got team speak over there. I see uh, aviation panels. Pilot edge is here. I mean, everybody, it's a who's who. I've already run into uh, Sean. We ran into Brad M a second ago on stream. I don't think anyone was in here yet. So, Kevin, how you doing? I just saw you on Gong Stream. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we caught each other. We, we we streamed each other as we ran into each other. So. Uh, yeah, we ran the Gong Show Kid, John Fly. We had a whole GSA like meetup just kind of just sporadically happen. Um, it's been pretty cool. Um, I believe over here, I'm going to take you down this way, is uh, where Honeycomb is, which is one of the things I'm really looking forward to checking out. They've got a yoke and a throttle system that uh, I'm really interested in seeing if that's going to be something I'm interested in checking out in the future here. Yeah, here's the Honeycomb booth over here. So they've got this, uh, yeah, check out this yoke. Look at that thing, that is pretty sweet looking. And the throttle quadrant on the other side there. So yeah, we're gonna be, we're gonna be checking this out for sure because it looks pretty nice, so. That's gonna be cool. Yeah, no, we'll, we'll see what it's like and I'll give you guys a review on it definitely because I'm, I'm interested in that one for myself. Let's see who else we can find here that we know. Uh, see if I see Captain Tim roaming around here. We had uh, dinner with him last night and Erin. That was really cool to get to meet her and see her. There's Brad M. Now that I actually have people watching, talking to somebody else. And over here we got real, real sim gear. This is where if you got lots of money, <laughs> you can get some really cool things. Check this out. The whole center console, all kinds of fun stuff. This is uh, Brian from West Wind. Met him here just a little bit ago. So there you go. And oh, Jeff, here's 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 the stuff that I want: actual throttle quadrants. I need to get more money though to do that. <laughs> I'm not that rich yet. We got some cool things. Uh, David, how's it going? Expo is going well. It is a lot of fun meeting lots of people. State level avionics. Somewhere around here is the uh, Laminar um, landing uh, competition. Here's the, this is the Thrustmaster booth. So they've got, they're here this year. They've got all kinds of stuff. And uh, so if you're looking for some good joysticks and pedals, they got some excellent Thrustmaster stuff going on here. So we got them explaining some stuff here. Just gonna take you around, obviously, over here a little bit. The Thrustmaster used that one. Is that what you're saying? So here's some more of the Thrustmaster stuff over here. Some of their options, Potas and, and what have you. Oh, I just found Chili Willies. So there's Chili. Say hi to him. I don't know where the uh, someone told me where they were doing the landing competition. I have yet to find it. So when I find it, I will let you know. We're gonna try it. Turns out the landing competition is done in VR. So uh, yeah, he just we just were in that panel where he hosted that. He was thrust us before Sight Tech. Oh, okay. Yeah, a lot of people. There's TFDI. Did that at the beginning there. 
You got Infinite Flight over there, MS Elite. Uh, uh, that looks like Cat Strader over there, over yonder. There's Flight Chops. Kind of hard to miss them with the Flight Chops. There's Squirrel right there. Just walked past Squirrel. <laughs> For those of you that know him, he's a huge streamer. How's it going? Hey, hey, Roshan, you're on you're on stream. How you doing? This is, oh, really? Yeah, this is one of the guys that watches uh, Chris D a lot of times, I know. Here's, uh, speaking of Chris D, there he is. Say hi to the Moose Crew community. And there's uh, his son, AJ. Hello. Are you streaming? Hey, I am streaming live, yep. Uh, so, say hi to, to, to uh, Yoshin. How you say it? Yoshin. Yoshin? Yeah. Yoshin. He is from Seoul. In Korea, he is a long way from home right now. <laughs> you, know, you think we had a long flight? He yeah, had a long flight. About so. 20, hours. Twenty hours. Oh my gosh! So well, you're a better man than I am. <laughs> well, good to meet you, sir. Yeah, thanks to meet you. We'll see you around. I'm just giving them a quick tour of the the place. So there's a Rev. He goes by. <laughs> there you go. Say hi, Rev. There you go. <laughs> this is the uh, the FS Elite booth. I don't know if this is like a photo studio or what's going on over here, but uh, she does not look heavy. Yeah, she was a little camera shy. That's his daughter. There's uh, Cat Strader, big on uh, YouTube and Twitch. Pilot Edge booth over here. So we got, it's a, it's a lot going on. There's a lot to take in. It's just, here's the, oh, here you guys go. Here's the quality wings. They're, uh, I don't know if they're demoing, if this is the, the 10 or not they're demoing, but this is quality wings. And they have, they're using one of the honeycomb yolks here, so we're going to have to check that out over here. It's easier to check that out and see. So, got to see Ramsey over there. Yeah, exactly, yeah, after the accident. So check these out. These are the uh, IL-2 uh, little uh, demo units. Really cool looking. So yeah, this is uh, this is uh, Gary right over here in the gray. He's the only has the uh, flight uh, the UK uh, sim flight UK sim or whatever it is uh, 747 cockpit at his house. And then we're back to Active Sky. This is uh, this is the VAT sim setup right here. They are running the uh, the new codec now, and uh, so be a chance to uh, check that out today and see that. Uh, there's there's uh, one in Cosford that happens. I think it's in October. Um, those are the only two that I'm aware of that are flights and conventions. That was in, in the UK, um, but this is the biggest one in North America. And the, I mean, flights in con. What used to be flights in con is happening. Today, I believe this weekend, online only, it's 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 dead. I mean, <laughs> let's just be honest. <laughs> let's just be honest. Stop by near 851 Zulu, and you might find me. All right, I'll do my best. So, it's really good stuff. Well, you can just see it's just it's it's a it's a buzz with uh, people. We have a I think I said there's about 1,500 registrants this year, up from last year, about 1,100 in Vegas. They have not yet announced where it will be next year. They teased it this morning, but they have not said. So I will let you know as soon as I know uh, where that might be happening. So find KDRU. Okay. Are you coming? I thought you said it was like you were coming out of here or New Orleans. Is that somewhere over there? Not Lombard, yeah. I'm guessing it's going to be Vegas too, but who knows? We'll see. I won't. I won't uh, make any real speculations until it actually happens. You lied, you're not coming out of New Orleans. Uh, here's Aerosim Gaming. You can tell because of his shirt, it makes it obvious. So for those of you that know uh, of his uh, Twitch channel. So yeah, it's, uh, it's been a good event so far. We had a really good uh, evening. Last night, hanging out with some Vatsim guys. Some of the founders of Vatsim, actually, I ran into that live in Jacksonville. Spotted my Jags hat. So, my 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 hat actually has a uh, has some purpose down here. I'm in I'm, I'm with my people in Florida. <laughs> so, so yeah. There comes the gambling. So yeah, you guys, you need to make it a point to try to be here next year. This is this is just too cool to uh, to miss. There's so many, not only just uh, networking opportunities with people and meet your favorite streamers, but you're getting to, to see the latest and greatest of the equipment. 
the, uh, the new stuff that people are coming out with. You get to talk with developers and kind of give them your opinion. And uh, I am wearing the moose hat right now here. I'll, I'll switch the camera over for a second so you can see. So there, there's the moose hat at the moment. Uh, I was wearing the Jags hat yesterday, so I'm going to go back to you. have to look at my ugly mug the whole time. Um, but you get to, to interact with uh, developers and give them your opinions and, and ask them things about that you care about. And they, then that's why they're here. They love to hear from you and find out what the community is saying about their products so they can make it better. So uh, it's not even six hours away for you, Kevin, if it's in Vegas. Um, it's six hours from Fresno. From you, it's probably four. Um, so yeah. Mike Hayden, Vats M10. Yeah, exactly. I uh, met him last night. Great guy. Great guy. There is uh, Durka Durka with his uh, stream setup and Squirrel right there in the back of Squirrel's head. <laughs> I'm doing well, Durka. How you doing? Yeah, you. Good to see you, my man. Good to see you. So this is uh, Nico's uh, just chatting booth over here. I haven't seen Nico yet, though. Although that might be him right there. So... They had a John fly there in the back, and uh, yeah, everybody's here. So you gotta be here. For, you gotta be here next time. No, so, yeah, you gotta go next year. Yes, there are. Uh, there, there's uh, a, a number of um, uh, conferences is the right word. A number of uh, seminars that we're gonna be uh, listening on. I don't know if I'm gonna stream too many of them because uh, FS Elite is doing that on their Twitch. So I think I'll let them take the lead on that. They probably have better audio than I do anyway. But, uh, but yeah, check this thing out. This is a full-on like Redbird simulator that people can try out. You got someone up there doing that right now, getting ready. So audio is good. Well, that's good to know because I can't tell. <laughs> I have no indication <laughs> of what my audio is doing. So. Yeah, so it's fun. So I'm going to be streaming uh, on and off throughout the day as things come up. Uh, as I try different stuff, I'll try to see if I can get someone to hold this while we do some stuff. So just kind of stay tuned. Uh, it'll probably be a lot of on-the-fly stuff. Uh, you're at the shelter and there's a new cat. His name is Rocky. He's sweet. And so nice. Good to see you, Kelsey. Welcome to the stream. He's been talking the entire time. <laughs> How dare you, Kevin? How dare you? <laughs> How dare you? So, yeah, just I can't I can't stress it enough. There's uh, Chili Willies right there. I can't stress it enough. You got to come next year. If you if you didn't make it this year, start saving now. You got to be here next year. There's uh, Matt Bartels, one of the Vatsim guys. So yeah, you got to come next year. Big old Navigraph booth. <laughs> Ten months. That's right. Awesome, Kelsey. Thank you so much for that support. Yeah, Chili's always super busy. What was that overhead panel you just passed? Uh, overhead panel? I don't know. I didn't see an overhead panel. There's the Airbus one that we were looking at earlier, but I don't know that I saw the... Uh... You talking about this guy over here? This isn't an overhead panel, but it's a big panel. You talking about that thing? Oh, it was on TV. Oh, okay. Good okay. business deal. Gotcha. All right. All right. So I think uh, no further back. Further back. That was this is further back. Is there, oh, maybe you caught. Oh, that's right. You guys may not have been on stream. When I showed this earlier. Let's go. Let's go check that out. I know what you're talking about. Whoop, excuse me. I know what you're talking about. And it is over here. Well, this may not be what you were talking about because you may not have seen it, but, but you got to see it. <laughs> this is too cool. It's Airbus, but it's too cool. So I'm just going to make my way over here. They've got a full-on Airbus cockpit set up over here. So, yeah, check this out. You want to talk about ultimate flight sim setup. This is it right here. Overhead panel, big old giant screen. So yeah, can you imagine how much that costs? <laughs> that's a lot. That's that's a 
that takes a bit more than just some walking around money, I'll tell you to get that. So. Yeah, that's the only overhead panel I know about that I saw. Yeah, thirty dollars. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. So, all right. I think we're gonna uh, we're gonna cut it there, and I'm gonna uh, I'll be back with you guys a little bit later. We'll we'll be streaming some more. Uh, you can check out the beginning of this video now that once it's posted to kind of uh, see what you missed before you guys came in here. And again, uh, two hundred thousand moose miles. Two hundred twenty thousand moose miles. Yeah, exactly. I think a little bit more than that. So, again. Get here next year. You got to be here next year. It's too much fun. And as uh, we find other people to, to showcase, we'll do some uh, some talks with them hopefully. So we'll see you guys later. Enjoy, and uh, we'll be back with you later today with some more uh, some more live live from Expo. You guys have a good one.